Welcome to the support videos for workload automation video series. In this video, you will see how Controlm interacts with SAP events. Here we have a Controlm job waiting for an SAP event. One way to set up this interaction is to have the Controlm job wait for a condition. The condition will be created once the SAP event was raised. Here we have a job waiting for a condition named store close. Let's define the event in SAP. This is done with transaction SM64. We'll create an event called store close. Now we configure event watcher management from the configuration manager. Select a profile to use that connects to the SAP system where the event resides. Load the SAP event history profiles. We want to make sure here there's one that's active. Let's define the event to watch. Remember we created an event called store close earlier. We'll wait for a value of 1. When the event is raised, we want to add a condition named store close. Go ahead and click apply. And we also want to make sure it's active. Go ahead and click OK. After enabling event watcher management, Check recycle the control for SAP extractor. Let's raise the event with a value of 1. Let's go take a look at our job in Control M. We see that the job has already executed and ended OK already. And we can see now that the condition that was needed was posted. Thank you for your time. This concludes this Control Solution video.